हेलो डॉक्टर्स वेलकम बैक टू जब स्टडीज मेट पन एम डॉक्टर ऐश्वर्या मोकल एंड दिस इज योर पार्ट थ्री फॉर कम्युनिटी मेडिसिन प्रीवियस ईयर इमेज बेस्ड क्वेश्चन सो द फर्स्ट द ओनली टॉपिक विल बी एनकाउंटरिंग टुडे इज आर द नेशनल हेल्थ प्रोग्राम सो मोस्ट ऑफ दीज हैव बिन आस्ट बिफोर अगेन नॉट ऑल ऑफ द नेशनल हेल्थ प्रोग्राम्स हैव बिन इंक्लूडेड इन दिस वीडियो सो वेन यू रीड द थियोरी पार्ट यू हैव टू गो थ्रू ऑल द नेशनल हेल्थ प्रोग्राम्स दीज आर ओनली हाई ईल्ड एंड पी वाई क्यू इमेजेस सो प्लीज टेक अ नोट ऑफ दैट so we will first start with the national health uh, mission itself so what is the national health mission it is given by the ministry of health and family welfare by the government of india it includes all other health programs of india like all of the health programs of india that we are going to see right now are all included in the national health mission so the major targets of the national health mission are the following it is very important to uh, revise these three major targets that is maternal mortality rate less than 100 per lakh live births which is currently 113 per lakh live births the next one is infant mortality rate less than 25 for uh, per 1000 live births which is currently at 32 per 1000 live births the next one is total fertility rate which should be 2.1 it is currently 2.2 so the couple production rate shall be more than 60% and the net reproductive rate shall be what the first national health program we will be looking at is ayushman bharat program so it is also known uh, under the umbrella term pradhan mantri jan aarogya yojana so in pradhan mantri jan aarogya yojana it provides a cover of 5 lakh per family per annum for secondary and tertiary care across public and private empanel hospitals it covers more than 50 crore population in below poverty line and uh, it subsumes other national health protect protection schemes so 1.5 lakh plus health and welfare uh, health and wellness centers will be established under the ayushman bharat program next one is national tuberculosis elimination program the uh, the particular uh, slogan for this is tb harega desh uh, desh jeetega it is a new name for revised national tuberculosis control program that is the rntcp with a new logo so the logo has a, a person red colored person with a sash uh, in the colors of the tiranga which says tb mukt bharat for this you need to uh, remember the drugs as well that are the drug regimens that are given to tb patients so category 1 and 2 are treated with the same regimen of hrzd that is 2 months intensive phase plus hre 4 months continuous phase the next one is poshan abhiyan it is the pms po overarching scheme for holistic nutri uh, nourishment it is a multi ministerial convergence mission with a vision to ensure attainment of malnutrition free india by 2022 it is under the ministry of women and child development uh, through anganwadi centers so the uh, so the particular logo and the uh, slogan is given here sahi poshan desh roshan national family planning program which has the logo of a couple with a single child so the uh, so the particular slogan are very important for this they might be asking logos but the next thing they will ask will will be slogans so it is on the safer side it is uh, very very important to remember the slogans for national family planning program the slogan will be jodi zimmedar jo plan kare parivar it is the promotion of contraception it has an extensive education educational approach it also provides home delivery of contraception and the one of the frequently asked questions is the urine pregnancy test kit given in, under this program is the nischay kit janani shishu Shura, suraksha karyakram it is a free diagnostic free drugs free delivery free diet free blood uh, free blood transfusion are the components of this janani uh, shishu suraksha karyakram it has a newborn care corner newborn stabilization unit special newborn care unit and home based newborn care national vector born disease control program the logo is pretty easy 
it is a family which is protected by this red shield which has this vector as a mosquito it's, this program includes malaria dengue filariasis kaya azar uh, japanese encephalitis and chikungunya fever program includes as in program includes protection against all of these diseases national leprosy elimination program that is nlep in this the logo is of a lotus flower uh, of a pinch holding a lotus flower and inside the pinch you can uh, pinch of fingers you can see there is there is there is this rising sun it is a uniform uh, there will be a uniform multi drug therapy for all kinds of patients uh, all all patients of leprosy that is a three drug regimen of dapsone plus rifampicin plus plus clofazimine for uh, leprosy the uh, important thing to remember is nikosht it is an icd based online tracking and surveillance system for leprosy patients at NL in nlep next one is mission indradhanush very famous because we have all uh, we have to uh, learn the vaccination uh, schedule for uh, which comes under the mission indradhanush it includes 100% coverage for 11 vaccines that is tb polio diphtheria pertussis tetanus hepatitis b measles rotavirus mr ipv je preventable diseases by 2020 through catch up campaigns anemia mukt bharat for anemia mukt bharat the logo is very important why i will tell you uh, it is the objective is to reduce prevalence of anemia by 3% every year by 2022 so the strategy has been asked before for this anemia or mukta bharat the strategy is 666 that is six beneficiaries six interventions and six in institutional mechanisms so over here you can see a blood drop with six individuals which will help you remember the strategy for anemia mukta bharat as well as the logo the next national health program that we will be encountering is a national program for prevention and control of diabetes cardiovascular diseases and stroke that is all the comorbidities so under this program there will be health promotion opportunistic screening referral diagnosis and management of non communicable diseases the next one is national iron deficiency disorder control program so in this sorry in this uh there is a there is a particular of level of iodinization of the salt at production level which is important so at production level it is 30 parts per million and at consumer level it should be 15 parts per million of uh, million of iron this has been asked previously in the exam the next one is pradhan mantri surakshit maitritva abhiyan uh, also known as suman so it is free antenatal care checkups on 9th of every month uh, for the pregnant woman for national health insurance most of the times they do as the logo so logo for it shows a uh, individuals uh, of a family so rashtriya uh, rashtriya swasthya bima yojana is another name for the national health insurance program national disaster response force the national disaster disaster response force is under the national disaster management authority the chairperson is the prime minister nodal ministry of uh, the nodal ministry is the home affairs and the nodal central is the district world Redu world disaster reduction day is 13th of october all of these are volatile points which can be asked in the exam national aids control organization national aids control organizations loco is uh, basically naco with the red ribbon for the Uh, which symbolizes the protection or the awareness against aids national program for control of blindness and visual impairment in national uh, program for control of blindness and visual impairment, impairment there are certain topics that are asked uh, there are certain points that are asked in the exam so blindness what is blindness blindness is basically vision less than 3 out of 60 in best eye with best possible correction 
asked millions of times i suppose the most common cause is cataract and uh, um, cataract more than refractive errors prevalence it's uh, the 0.36 percent uh, and uh, the goal is less than 0.3 percent in vision 2020 india it is uh, uh, basically a right to sight initiative the objective is to eliminate all causes of avoidable blind blindness that is cataract uh, re childhood blindness trachoma diabetic retinopathy glaucoma corneal blindness so the vision center is uh, the vision center this this is basically a hierarchy vision center service center training center center of excellence apex school in the apex school one teacher is equal to 150 students and the referral for the, these centers is vision less than six out of nine the next one is employee state act which was given in 1940 by ministry of labor government of india the contribution of the employer will be 3.25 percent of the wages and for the employee will be 0.75 percent of the wages in which sickness benefit will be given 91 days with 70 percent of the wages extended sickness benefit will be for two years with 80 percent of the wages and maternity benefit will be 26 weeks with 100 percent wages the next one is pradhan mandri ujwala yojana in which uh, which is given by the Ministry of Petroleum and Natural Gas. So, free LPG connection to below poverty line uh, families and gas cylinders at subsidized rates under this program. Last but not, not the least, Aarogya Setu. We are very, very uh, familiar with this particular logo. So, what is Aarogya Setu is, it was a mobile application developed by the government of India to connect essential health services with the people of India in our combined fight against COVID-19. So, this was asked just as a uh, image based question like the image of the app was given that's it so thank you so much that is that's it for today please follow our fmg mantra please follow us on instagram telegram and please uh, subscribe job studies met fun on youtube for more such videos thank you